Hey everyone, welcome back to Geek Strong. In today's video, it's all about a pilot. Kinda. If you watched my latest video, you know that I managed to pick up the pilot from Blue Thunder, which is one of my grail items. The Blue Thunder helicopter I've always wanted in my collection. I've never seen it in person, never touched it, but I've loved the Blue Thunder movie back in the 80s. And the Blue Thunder pilot, when I found it in store, blew my mind. So I had to get the helicopter. So guess what? Have it right here. So what do you say? Let's do this. Okay, first impressions. What a piece of junk. All right, let's see what's in here. I think there's parts are probably in here. Let's see how this opens up. Here we go. Yeah, here is the front gun piece right there. So, Honestly, I'm actually a little surprised because I had no idea it was missing this part here, the landing gear. You know that. But it was $16, as I said. And to display it as a placeholder like that, <laughs> I guess it's not too bad. I mean, you know, I would really like to get a nice minty one but I can't see spending a couple of hundred dollars so if I was to display it like this I guess it wouldn't be too bad right but let's take a closer look at it All right, let's take a close look let's turn these blades so the front here this must go like that and it's like the the gun or is this like a supposed to be like a mic or something because I believe this is this is molded or modeled after the TV show so this didn't have guns here I guess from the TV show but I'm using it as the movie so it looks like that could be glued like that and so does this part move up like that maybe I don't know we'll I'll glue that sometime but let's take a look at it so we do have we're missing a gun here or uh, whatever it was this looks like it's missing a piece here that's broken off possibly but check out the cockpit so it looks like we have I don't want to break it anymore there we go looks like you can looks like you can put somebody in the back there too right but you can put one pilot there so overall I guess it's not horrible <laughs> is this would you call it a piece of junk or would you say for $16 and $7 shipping it's really not a bad piece to display instead of spending the $200 or for a complete one if I was lucky enough to find one for 100 bucks that was complete that would be fantastic um, even 125 but once you start getting into 150, 200 and higher, eh, it's really a tough one. So for the price, I'm happy with it, but I was actually I'm actually really surprised that it's missing the landing parts here. I guess I should have, you know, I actually saw it from here they showed a picture, but I thought it was a different view. But 
It still has the stickers, which is cool. Blue Thunder. And I will be looking for... Who knows, man? Maybe I find another beater and I can piece it up. If I can find a beater for $10 that had the landing gear and another propeller. You know, and some and, and a gun. And it was missing, like, parts down here. You never know. But for now... I'm kind of happy. I like it. It's 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 pretty big, isn't it? Look at the size of this thing. Check it out. What a piece of junk. So let's get a tape measure here. So this is actually 18 inches long. So that's pretty cool. So overall, what do you think? Do you think I made a bad choice in purchasing this? Or do you think it's uh, a pretty good placeholder? Because if you display it like that, up against the wall or something like this right because that's pretty much how you would display it maybe glue this piece on let's see so I guess it wouldn't be too bad you could prop it up a little bit like that and here's the pilot so let's put the pilot in here his knees do bend so let's put him in here like that. Close it up. Pretty cool, I guess, you know, for a, uh, like, like uh, Luke Skywalker said, what a piece of junk. But I'm pretty happy, I guess, you know, it would be nice if it, I guess, the one thing I was shocked about is, like I said, the other landing piece. But th that's what it looks like inside. We'll take a closer look at the control panel, if you can see that. Let's see if we can zoom in a little bit. But, yeah, I guess that's... Let's see the sticker. What does it say? Beware of blast. And blue thunder right there. And I think it's missing part of its rear wings here. So there you go, the Blue Thunder helicopter. If you want to see a full review on a more minty Blue Thunder, check out Super Awesome Geek Show's video. I'll leave a link in the description. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, do all that good stuff. Remember, we are all Geek Strong. Take care, everyone. She may not look like much, but she's got it where it counts.